What's up Cancer? Welcome back to my channel. It's me Jose Alfredo Ra. This is going to be your message for July 7th, 2021, right? So hope you're doing great. Hope you're enjoying the month, right? Summertime is here. If you're here like uh, somewhere in the United States, right? <laughs> um, in the East, right? So the setup is a little different. I kind of wanted to like showcase uh, the artwork from the tarot decks that I'm using right now. So I'm going to use three tarot decks, um, the Mirror Tarot, the Life Seers Tarot, and the Mystical Manga Tarot. I'm going to pull four cards from each one and then just give you all the messages that come through. Remember, go to the About section, right, um, on my channel so you can see how to set up um, or how to make a request, right, for um, a personal video how to um, purchase my candles on my website, right, josealfredora.com, um, how to follow me on my other social media platforms, right, TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. All that info is there, so please check it out. Um, also remember, comment, like, share, subscribe, right? Share the energy with me. All right. So, Cancer, let's get this going. Let's see what we have first for my Cancer. No matter what placement in Cancer, right? North node, South node, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ace of Coins. Nice. Two of Coins. Interesting. A new opportunity, right? For manifestation with the Ace of Coins. New abundance. It could be something like a new relationship or something, but a decision. So, uh, kind of like a decision you're going to have to make on how do you balance out this energy? How do you give your energy in, into more than one direction, how to keep yourself grounded and stable. First card out is the Ace of Pentacles, so strong, right? So very beautiful card to start off with. And heavy pentacle energy, which is heavy coins energy, which is earth energy around you right now. So you could be feeling very grounded, right? Very stable, very focused on your day-to-day -day mundane. Now you have the Ace of Cups. Come on, Cancer. New opportunity coming your way, and this also could be supported by new love. Okay, so we're taking this one. There we go. And the full, start something new. Now you have the Ace of Cups, self-love, right? And also new love. And you have the full card, okay? Which means starting over from the beginning. But you know, in the full, when you start off from the beginning, you, you already have that information or you, already, you still have the experiences that you have with you, right? You take that with you, but you start a new journey. <clears throat> also, zero, starting from spirit. So this is definitely something that the universe is guiding you towards, right? Your spirit guides, ancestors, God, the universe is guiding you towards this. And it's new love, but you know how you're good at nurturing yourself, right? Being the sign that everyone says, be like cancer, focus on um, nurturing yourself, right? So Ace of Cups definitely says fill up your cup first, but a new cup is coming your way. And Ace of Coins, so two Aces. Right? Very beautiful to get two aces first. So it could be, oh, Scorpio energy popping out there with the death card. So a transformation definitely will be happening for you. Right? With the ace of coins and the ace of cups. This is you probably needing to start a new, a new chapter in your life. With the death card, there's going to be some type of transformation that you need to go through. Seven of Cups is saying you're going to have to make a choice and a decision, right? And with the wheel, right, it's because you're going to have to either close out some cycles or start some new cycles in your life, right? So you could either have Scorpio in your chart, right? Or there could be a Scorpio around you. First card out for here, so very strong energy. Seven of Cups, make a decision or a choice. There's going to be options for you. And this is water sign, right? One more for Cancer, please. After the wheel. One more for Cancer, thank you. Oof, oh, why Cancer, the devil card. Capricorn energy. There's a cycle of some unhealthy behavior patterns, people, right? Habits, if I didn't say that, that you will have to make sure, right, that you don't choose and that you end. Okay, make sure you choose wisely because you don't want to catch yourself on um, cancer, right? Repeating a cycle 
of unhealthy behaviors, unhealthy patterns. Okay? Because these two new opportunities are going to be amazing for you. The Ace of Coins and the Ace of Cups. But you're definitely going to have to get yourself grounded, balanced energetically if you want to start this, right? New journey, a new cycle, right? Because it's telling you you need to. You're getting, right, the full then Scorpio with transformation and then the will. So you're definitely being told it's time for you to make some changes. And it could be work related and it could be love related because you have the Ace of Coins and the Ace of Cups. All right, what else do we have for Cancer? Nine of Cups, look at that. So, Nine of Cups and the Emperor. So definitely this Nine of Cups tells me that that Seven of Cups will open up a cycle for you that will lead to uh, a wish fulfillment, okay, with the Nine of Cups. You can't see that one that much, right? Give me just a second. Okay, I wanna keep everything in the shot but this angle here. Okay, and then you have the Emperor, Aries energy. So this could just be you needing to be in this Emperor energy, right? In your personal power, knowing that you're the leader of your life, controlling every situation that you come across, or this could be an Aries presenting themselves to you, right? Wanting a connection with you. What are the next two messages for Cancer, please? All right, what are the next two messages for Cancer? Nine of Cups, amazing to get. So you have Capricorn so far, Scorpio energy coming out in your reading, and Aries with the Emperor, okay? So those could be energies that you need to tap into that, or that are around you. With the Eight of Wands, um, focus, taking swift action, something will be coming towards you very quickly, okay? Maybe it could be this Emperor coming towards you. And that is also the energy of Virgo and Sagittarius, okay, with the Eight of Wands. I think Sagittarius again with the Nine of Wands. So continue to be, this one says defensive, right? But I definitely feel like Eight of Wands, Nine of Wands, the Emperor who also could be coming across, right, with like a little bit of Capricorn, the Devil energy, maybe the one that's going to come towards you. And you could possibly have your guard up right in that connection with the capricorn devil card or the emperor aries card okay but also it is a card of persevering and eight of wands definitely says like this is new this is um you know with the eight of wands it's the universe sending you swift moving action swift moving opportunities right New experiences, either new people coming towards you or someone you already know coming towards you, okay? All right, Cancer. So you got two blessings, Ace of Cups, right? And the Ace of Coins coming your way. Just be mindful. You're being told it's time for you to start a new journey. Get yourself planted, feet on solid ground. Make a decision how you're going to divide your energy between something that could be work-related and something that could be new love. It's time for you to go through transformation with the Scorpio card. Think wisely before you make that decision because you will have options. And, but some of those options won't be um, be won't benefit you, okay? So make sure that you close out any cycles of anything that won't work out for you. And only open yourself up, right, to cycles that'll be that'll lead you to like a wish fulfillment. Remember to be in that power of the emperor right now. Take the lead of your life and control. Make sure that you move with swift action and keep persevering with the nine of wands. Keep your defenses up for anything that is no good for you. All right, that is your message, Cancer. Um, remember, if it resonates, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, I love you very much, Cancer, and I will see you all next week. Take care, bye.